What is going on everybody? It's Hayes Carlson coming at you over here at Floyd's RV in beautiful Norman, Oklahoma. And today I got something pretty special for you. Right now we're gonna be taking a look at this Beacon. Now this is a Van Lee product and they are a division of Tiffin, which has been around for a long time. They were in the motor home game for a while and decided to try their hand at fifth wheels. And guys, they knocked it out of the park. This thing is so, so, so cool. So starting off back here, in our very rear storage area, we are going to have our magnet doors up top so we can let them go. And then this huge pull-out storage bin that takes up to 800 pounds on this side. So no matter what you guys are doing or what you're gonna be putting in here, we're gonna have a place to put it with easy access. And then whenever we want to bring it back in, easy as that. And then we can shut this guy down it does have the slam doors that you'll notice these doors over here are going to be more storage over by our uh by our slide out there and you can see our slide out we have more storage over on this door as well as the other side and then as we move right along you'll notice that the paint on this thing is absolutely beautiful now this is motorhome quality paint it does have seven layers worth of paint on here as well and then they also hook you up with some extra paint if it happens to get scratched or anything like that. Once again, with the magnet doors, our full pass-through storage, a couple of chairs here, as well as our auto level system. Now here is where we can winterize as well as hook up the entire unit. So we'll have our gray tank, black tank, our cable in, our water pump going on, uh, what we can do with our tank fill, whether we want to pump, go on city water or winterize. We can also bypass and then we do have an ice maker on the inside as well as our outdoor shower winterizing and our tank flush and this is a water filter as well so guys as we move right along just next to that we will have a place for our propane tanks now this is equipped with two 30 pound propane tanks and with our auto level system we are going to have six points worth of contact on the ground so guys moving right along underneath here we will have some a place to put a generator that we are pre-wired for as well as our hydraulics for our auto level system and uh, places for our battery and you'll notice that we do have the slam doors as well as our uh, solar charge ports because we are pre-wired for solar charging now with our front cap it is fiberglass with this nice automotive grade paint and then our fifth wheel hook up here keeping going around we have another 30 pound pro propane tank there as well as the rest of our pass-through storage and then we also have cable hookups as well as a charger so we can watch some tv while we're outside can't get enough of the slam doors on this thing notice the frameless windows nice and seamless look and then our awning there, frameless windows over here, and then more storage with our slide outs, two axles with our road armor. Now guys, this is filled with nitrogen on our 10 ply tires. And then we can go inside this bad boy. We do have the solid steps as well as our lend a hand handy dandy handle. Guys, drop me a comment down below and let me know what your favorite feature on the outside is. And let me know what you like about the inside too because this is where it gets really really crazy let's check it out all right now i can hear you guys a little bit better you can hear me anyway i should say but check out our full residential kitchen absolutely beautiful now guys all of the woodwork that you're seeing all of the furniture that you're going to see inside of this rv is made across the street from where they manufacture this beacon. Every single piece of wood, every single piece of furniture is specifically designed and handcrafted for this specific unit. So there's not a mass production of cabinets or furniture that is going into all of the different Vanley products. Everything that you're seeing in here was put in here for a reason, just specifically for this trailer. Moving right along, we'll have our wine cooler a nice nook so we can have a coffee bar or an actual bar with some boozy drinks. Of course, we'll have our drawers that are full extension and they are slam drawers. 
So no matter how hard we're gonna push those guys in, it is not going to slam. Same thing with our cabinets as well. Tons of cabinet and storage space, four burner gas stove, as well as our full size oven that we could stick an entire turkey in. Farm style sink that is stainless steel and solid surface countertops that we can cut on. Antimicrobial and easy wipe. We do have a chef's nozzle that we can select different sprayer modes, as well as our full residential microwave, our full residential refrigerator that is absolutely enormous with the pull-out freezer, as well as our ice maker and fresh water. Now going over here, you'll notice that we're gonna have a lot more storage with our slam doors that are not going to slam on us. And then opening this up, just a ton of storage here in the kitchen. You'll notice that we have a full motorhome style roof, as well as our fantastic fan that is going to get any odors, as well as any hotter air out. Now moving on to the den, you're gonna notice that we have our nice big mountain view windows. We can use these to get our full blackout. We do have a televator. So this is going to bring our TV right up whenever uh, we wanna watch. Also our infotainment system with our speakers. We are going to have speakers mounted all the way around, giving us a surround sound feel. Our 40 inch Furion uh furnace there as well as more storage on either side and guys like i said this furniture is specifically made for this unit and guys this is a pull out bed and we can do that over here as well as over on this side that's why i have the uh, cushions over on this side here and we'll have our theater style seating with USB chargers as well as our master switches everywhere. Notice that we have our valances, again with our high quality handcrafted wood all the way around and our nice big spacious den. And then as we go down, you'll notice that we have a handle here on the studs. We will have lights by our feet so we can see where we're going as well as master switches so we can have a light master on, light master off, TV lift up, lift down, and then our slides over here as well. And we're gonna have multiple master switches throughout the coach. Now over here, you'll notice that we do indeed have two different style of shades. So we can have our mesh style shade, or we can have the true blackout shade as well. So we can kind of pick whichever one you guys are wanting to do. Now this table is a legless table. So whenever we are sitting down having a meal, we're not gonna be bumping knees with anybody unless you really just wanna play footsies with them. Moving right along, we'll have vents by our stairs as well as our built-in dirt devil. So we do have a vacuum attachment for this RV that uh, whenever we are going to sweep everything, we can sweep it right over here, open this guy up, and then that is going to suck in all of our dirt and debris Guys, you'll notice that we have our lights going upstairs. And then once we go into our shower, it is full walk-in, as well as our nice seat here that we can lift up and get out of the way if we wanted to. Our nice residential style sink. This is solid surface, and this is a residential sink there as well. More storage over on this side. What's going on, everybody? And then underneath our medicine cabinet, we'll have more storage there, as well as another fantastic fan. Our porcelain commode with a foot flush, plenty of outlets everywhere in this unit. And then guys, this is a residential door with an actual knob that is lockable over on the other side. And then we do have a magnet that will keep the door open for us. Moving right along inside of our king suite, you'll notice with our full size king bed that we'll have storage with air shocks underneath. Over here, we are going to have our washer and dryer hookups. So we can put either a combo or a uh, stackable washer and dryer on top of that. We do have a little shoe closet, uh, some space for some more shoes down there, as well as some hangers and more storage up top. Now we do have the opposing windows on both sides. That way we can get a nice cross breeze going whenever we are in bed. Again, with our master switches, 
those are pretty pretty cool to me and then guys you're gonna notice these little guys all along the coach now those are going to be your air conditioner sensors so that's going to talk to the automatic air control system letting it know what temperature we're at and how to adjust accordingly to get the most comfortable now you'll notice we have our big tv as well as our residential uh, dressers here and these are the no slam dressers so whenever we go to slam them shut it's not gonna let us plenty and plenty plenty of storage everywhere guys moving right along my personal favorite part is probably going to be the wine excuse me the wine cooler here i think that that's awesome i really love the roof now one thing that beacon does that not a lot of other people are going to do is they are already going to give you some touch-up paint so guys, if you could see yourself camping in this bad boy, let me know. Drop me a comment down below and let me know what your favorite part is. If you guys are interested in this thing, I'll have all the ways to get a hold of me down below, as well as my phone number, email address, Facebook page, and my inventory list. Guys, I hope you're having a great day and I'm gonna see you on the next.